you win is find a way to add more what? Value than anyone else is adding. If you do more for others than anybody else consistently, you will win, you will dominate, you will build a brand. But if you allow yourself to only do so much, the person you cheat is you. I interviewed Coach John Wood. Does anybody remember Coach Wood? Yeah. I interviewed him three times over my lifetime, and I had the last live interview before he died. He died a week later. And so I got to know him over almost 20 years. And he taught me something I'll never forget. I asked him the best team he ever had. What was the greatest, most successful team he ever had? The one he believed was the finest group of people, the most successful. And I thought I was going to say, some of you are old enough to remember Lou Alcindor, the game Jabbar, and all these guys, and they won 88 games in a row. I mean, this is not like the Chicago Bulls. Every year he has new players. So to have victories we win 10 out of 12 national NCAA championships, no one's ever done it, no one ever will again. How do we do that? Because he built men, he built people instead of just ball players. And he would not tolerate less than absolute optimum energy from any of you. He didn't have how good skill you were. He said, skill will be dwarfed by effort. And we forget today about effort. We all want to be strategic, which is so valuable, but it's the energy. And he said, I said, so what team? He picks this team. I never heard of it. I said, why? He said, because they maximize the potential. The team that won 88 games in a row did not maximize it. I said, wow. He said, Tony, there's only one definition of success. He said, for me, I taught every one of the players that came to work for me that you cannot control that score, but you can influence it. And there are going to be days when the score will be higher and the score will be lower. So the only way you're going to know if you won or not is did you give every ounce of your soul every moment you were on that court with not an ounce, not a minute, not a second of exception. Because if you give everything you have every moment you're in the game, 99, 95, 90, 80% of the time you're on the highest score. Sometimes someone will get lucky, the ball will drop, a bad call will happen. But only you, he said, but if you have the highest score, it doesn't mean you won. Only means you won if you gave everything you have. Because in life, what we give is what we keep forever. What we fail to give, we lose. And that's how I play. And I bet that's how you play a good deal of time. The question is, can you get yourself do all the time? Because if you do it all the time, you won't be doing 100 million. You'll be doing billions. And more importantly, you can be the owner.